you fine folks, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is America of America's Abstracts. If you're new here, hi! I use art to cope with my various chronic illnesses and as a result of that I do either a how-to video or a creation video twice a week on Thursdays and Sundays. Today's video is a how-to video. I don't know about you, but sometimes I mix up a batch of different colors and then I mix up a another different batch of colors and forget all about the first batch for a while. So today I'm going to show you how I thin out my older paints to then be able to use them up for the rest of the time. I have a nice little variety pack of different Pearl X pigments because like I said, I've definitely been using my This Little Piggy pigments for a while, so after I mixed all these up and then I got my This Little Piggies, these kind of got put by the wayside. But don't fret, I'm going to be using them. But first, let's thin these guys out. Alright, so there's not a lot in here, but you can kind of see that it just... It's kind of thick. I have other thicker ones, like this guy. See how it's just like staying? <laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. So, yes, you can use the last little bit of pigments. Um, you just have to thin them out. So, I like to cover all my bases. I use GAC 100 and I use GAC 800. So, the 100 is actually an, a primer and extender. This one is a low crazing extender. They're both, eh, they say about the same thickness, but I actually think that this guy's a little thinner than this one. Um, but without further ado, let's thin this guy out. So I'm going to take just squirt a little bit in there, the GAC 800, and squirt a little bit of there in the GAC 100. And we're going to stir those around. Essentially, we want it to actually stop globbing, so get like a GAC 800. really lumpy. I really forgot about these for a while. if like they're super thick like how mine were this is gonna take a few times of doing one of each okay so there we go do a blue green um I got another kind of thick boy a lot more to this guy so okay 100 there we go that's the consistency I want like warm honey all right and I'm just gonna go and do this to all of mine so then fine. Whoops. Sometimes I make a mess. Sometimes I make a mess. There we go. There's my warm honey. All right. Duo of brass, brass violet. Oh 
the last one. All right, one more. Okay, all right, so now that you've seen how to thin out your paints and pigments, well, these are all pigments, Perlix pigments, um, got a little bonus painting for you.